It's Wednesday morning, Scott's on vacation, but we're still doing hometown, hometown Scrabble. Yeah, we have no storms, so we can do it. So Let's it's all about it. this shirt, right? That's yeah. the shirt. You gotta fold the shirt. shirt, I'll tell you what happens. Yes. You ready? Yeah. This is Hometown Scramble. It's America's favorite made-up game show. We do it every Wednesday about this time. Here's what's gonna happen. We're gonna put up three names of towns, villages, or hamlets in the state of Connecticut. You have to unscramble them. See, we scramble them, you unscramble them. You tweet your answers to the at WFSB Morning Team Twitter account. If you're the first person who hasn't won before and you get them all correct, you could win that shirt. The shirt. You're supposed <laughs> to fold it. Oh, is it, I'm folding it now. Mark never worked <laughs> in retail, though, right? No, I worked no. in. Scott and I are similar in that we both our first jobs were at grocery stores. Oh, that's cool. Well, look, that's, that's not bad. That's not bad. Yeah, that's yeah, not Marie Kondo. Though. That's not bad. Oh, you should see my drawers. <laughs> you are very neat. Very well, organized. No, All right, let's see it. Who's got it? What's the theme? Should we go? Some? Okay, so this is from Diane Taylor, and this plays in nicely given that we're coming off of Thanksgiving. Um, that yesterday was Giving Tuesday. The the theme for this is oh. pay it forward. Oh, so, nice. so thank you to Diane Taylor from West Haven for submitting these. Uh, it's always nice because she is full of ideas and when I fill in for Scott, she just makes it easy for me. Someone has to do the work and it might as well be her. Might, <laughs> might as well. <laughs> thank you, Diane. All right, so we've got Pay Shuttle Mo, It Loan, and Forward Et. Pay It Forward. And the first one is two words. That's what the asterisk Yes, the asterisk. There. That is key. It is two words. The rest of them are one word, towns, villages, hamlets, cities. So. All right, we, we, have, we don't have any guesses Nothing in yet. yet. Uh, Renee, you want to tell us what the first one is? Hey, uh, Shalomo. Oh, listen, I could tell you what the second one is. Yeah, so could I, but why don't you tell us the first <laughs> one? <laughs> two words. South, uh, it is certainly south of something. Well, there's the first word All is All right, well, like we have a, a guess here. Tina Manillo says it's South Plymouth. Oh. Um, close, not south. Oh, east? no. East Plymouth? East. East. Oh. East Plymouth. All right. There we have it. All right, so it loan. <laughs> Uh, she, well, that one we all got. Even Renee knew that one. Yeah. <laughs> it's right. Wilton, Alex. Wilton it is. <laughs> and Me and my one I got. <laughs> uh, well, yeah, Tina doesn't have that one either. She says it's uh, a Redford, but I don't think that's a place. No, I don't either. It I, is uh, definitely a Robert. I don't remember this one. Well, let's just all find out together. All right, let's click click the button. And the answer is oh, oh Waterford. Of course, of course it's course Waterford. It is. Uh, I did not so, know that. Yeah, well, so no t-shirts given away today? Yeah, yeah, I guess we have a winner because it, it must have been tweeted before we gave them all away. Uh, Bridget Green. Oh, Never oh, won before, Bridget. now you have. Bridget Green. Right. Green. Congratulations. Got all three of them. So uh, Bridget, send me an email, weather3 at wfsb.com or mark.dixon at wfsb.com, either one. Uh, let us know what your shirt size is and as well your address. And then also uh, send us a selfie, a picture, and we'll put you on the air. It's our hometown <laughs> scramble winner for today. She got in moments before I was about to declare no winner. So oh. Bridget, <laughs> wow. congratulations, you win. Wonderful. All right. Very good. Thank you. Thank you for uh, participating this morning.